الحمد لله رب العالمين الرحمن الرحيم Assalamu alaikum everyone. In an authentic hadith, Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam said that the hour will not be established unless earthquakes become common in Muslim countries. We can see that in less than an year, there have already been a lot of earthquakes in Muslim countries like Turkey, Syria, Morocco, Afghanistan, and much more. And these aren't just normal earthquakes. These are massive earthquakes. They have a magnitude of over 6.8. In fact, just some time ago, in the country that I live in, which is Pakistan, there was a earthquake which was over 7 magnitude. How can a rational individual look at all of these earthquakes and think that this is not a sign of the Day of Judgment. How is it that Muhammad wasallam said that there would be earthquakes in Muslim countries and now we can see that there are a lot of earthquakes in Muslim countries. This could only mean one thing, that the end is near. And this isn't just about earthquakes. Let's take a look at another hadith. In this authentic hadith, Muhammad wasallam says that the hour will not begin until the Muslims fight the Jews. And we can see that recently Palestine and Israel have gone to war. Palestine being a Muslim country and Israel being a Jewish country. How is it that Muhammad wasallam said that when the hour will be established, then Muslims and Jews will go to war? And we can see that nowadays Muslims and Jews have went to war. This can only mean one thing, that the Day of Judgment is very, very near. With the war between Palestine and Israel and the earthquakes all around the world and the persecution of Muslims and the fact that Muslims are caring more about the dunya than the akhira. With all of this in mind, we can safely conclude that the Day of Judgment is extremely near. We are officially living in the end of times. So I suggest that this is the time you go and repent because who knows one day you just might be enjoying and having a good time with your girlfriend and then the day of judgment will happen. Allah is showing you the signs. Do not ignore them. That's all for today guys and until next time Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Allahu Akbar